You or someone you know may have been diagnosed with heart failure. This video will help you understand how heart failure affects your heart and body. If you have heart failure, your heart can't pump enough blood to meet your body's needs. This is because the pumping sections of your heart, called ventricles, may be weak or damaged. The walls of your ventricles may also be stiff and thickened. This may prevent them from filling with enough blood. You may have left-sided heart failure. This means your left ventricle does not deliver enough oxygen-rich blood to your body. When this happens, you feel tired and out of breath. Blood pressure also goes up in the blood vessels between your lungs and left ventricle. The higher pressure forces fluid out of your blood and into your lungs. Fluid in your lungs makes it harder for you to breathe. You may have right-sided heart failure. This means your right ventricle is too weak to pump enough blood to your lungs. The result is a buildup of blood in your veins. Blood buildup in your veins forces fluid into your body tissues. This is called edema. Over time, heart failure on either side of your heart results in weakened, enlarged ventricles. The weakened ventricles deliver less blood to your body. To make up for this, your nervous system releases substances called stress hormones. Stress hormones make your heart beat faster. Unfortunately, the stress hormones can also damage your ventricles and make your heart failure worse. The most common cause of heart failure is coronary artery disease. Other causes include high blood pressure, diabetes, heart valve problems, heart muscle damage, irregular heartbeats called arrhythmias, heart defects, poisons or substance abuse, lung disease, and breathing problems during sleep called sleep apnea.